Hey everybody, welcome back. We're at Build Show Network. I'm down in Columbia, Missouri. We're on the second floor of our Hilltop Arrow House. And I wanted to point out, it's a, it's a small part of the house that's kind of doing its part organically to the whole, but I think it's really important that we talk about the wall assembly that we're using here, more specifically what we're doing in the corner. So you can see here, basically, all of our stud framing is a two by six, 24 inch on center T stud. And the T stud is short for truss stud, right? So we have this basic thermal break that's happening inside the wall here. And then we have a cord here and a flat cord out here that we then attach our sheathing. It's really important to know, to understand that not only do we have that thermal break on here, but this is an R9 sheathing. So we have an R9 insulation and then we have our zip sheathing on the outside of that. So this is really a, a kind of bomb proof, inexpensive wall in, in the sense that it's not double wall framed. We're not going around the house two or three times with insulation. It's a standard framing package that the framer framed up. He just used T studs instead of two by sixes. And then instead of putting on half inch sheathing, he put on a two inch sheathing that just happens to have an R9 insulation panel. But let's talk about this corner. As we move into the corner, you can see we have two T studs there, which basically when we blow in our fibrous insulation in here, it's gonna fill all these nooks and crannies and it's gonna fill it right up against that R9 sheathing. Now, I know some of you might've heard the term California corner. Well, I'm here to tell you we're renaming it and we're calling it the Missouri corner. And a Missouri corner is that two stud corner, but it's done with the T stud here. And according to the T stud guys, we're talking a 300% plus efficiency in the T stud over a solid stick there. So, but I think it's really important, you know, that you see that here on the job site. Now, some of you are gonna say, what's happening to the drywall? Drywall will come in, we're gonna use some Advantech scraps. We're gonna have some drywall catches here where we'll catch that drywall, we'll finish this out, but this is a really good wall system that we could put pretty much anywhere USA. So let's jump back to the studio, grab my big, my uh, friend Big Red, we'll break it out and we'll talk wall assemblies. See you back at the studio.